to 21. And uh, before I get into you know, talking about the game and the plays and stuff, talk about this crowd that was here tonight celebrating you guys. Uh, a tough loss last week in the opener against Azusa. Another ranked opponent coming into our place. And uh, you guys get the big victory tonight. Talk about the crowd. Uh, again, it starts with our main motto, it's culture. And, and then they follow us with that. Uh, we had a tough loss last week. And there's there's no better support in football. And we played in many stadiums. And there's nothing like our home crowd. So they, we feed off of them. They're here driving us on. And, and it's all we can do. They're our heartbeat. So we're excited. You had a great game tonight. Had a big interception, in the, obviously, in the fourth quarter, uh, which uh, led to points for, for WT. But I want to ask you, as a senior leader on this defense, what were you saying to your team early when, when things weren't going our way? And, and even at halftime, when we were down by 10, and, and Colorado State football had the momentum because things shifted in the second half, obviously. Right. And, and, and another one, I mean, we, our coach is, is focused on models and changing culture. And, and one of them is uh, when faced with uh, uh, an opportunity or, or an obstacle, we put on more steam and fight against that pressure. We fight pressure with pressure. And iron, iron sharpens iron. And so we're just excited to, to keep getting better. As you see the improvement from last week to this week, we played with, with insane uh, passion, excitement, passion, and uh, our chemistry is better than ever. So we're excited to, to start conference playoff. You mentioned overcoming obstacles. And you know, I, I mentioned before the season got started this year, seeing number 51 out on the field uh, just brings a smile to my face because obviously last year had a, a tough injury early in the season that ended your season last year. You fought hard to come back from that injury. Talk a little bit about that, uh, the work that you've to put in, and how, how happy it makes you to be able to come out here and then play in these type of games. Right. So, I mean, this is 16 years plus of football for me, and I've been blessed to be healthy that long. So it's just another obstacle in the way. Fought back to get back on the field to have some fun with my guys. So, yeah. so we're just excited to, to keep this thing, change the culture, and, uh, and, and make West Texas great again. So, so. Okay, last question for you, Trevor, is uh, the, your interception. Take me through that play. Uh, as is, you made the big pick, and then you were running off the field celebrating with uh, with your teammates. But, but how'd you get the pick? Uh, really, we had, we had a great pass pressure from the D-line all night, and uh, they were forcing bad throws. I, this collision the guy was there, and it just fell in my lap. I just turned around trying to catch it. So uh, that's really all it is. But it took his that quarterback's got to check down to the receiver that I'm covering, and, yeah. and everyone's doing their job. And so we're, we're, we're playing as a real unit. Four turnovers tonight, forced by the defense. Great job. And the Buffs are 1-1. First victory for Hunter right. Hughes comes against his old team. Great job. That's right. Thank you very much.